What's up guys, we're here at the studio, which is actually under construction, and we're getting some final shots for the Iron Man effect in Chalk Warfare 3. After production, we actually realized that we can use a new technique of motion capturing with an Xbox Connect. Originally, we wanted to do just normal keyframing, but we were afraid that that wasn't going to give us the results we actually wanted. And I was a bit skeptical about this because I was afraid it would be glitchy. I watched some results on YouTube. But when done the proper conditions, you can actually get some pretty accurate results. And I'll just walk you through the workflow I have going on right now. So we have the Xbox Connect, and it's hooked directly up to my laptop, which has the iPi recorder and studio version software on it. Link will be in the description. Just check that out. In our case, we also have our T2i recording full HD video that's going to be synced up with the Kinect. The Kinect actually has a 24 millimeter focal length. So we have our 24 millimeter equivalent lens, which is about a 15 with our crop sensor, hooked up right above it, recording at the same time. Now what we first do is we get a clean plate and analyze the background. And then we have our subject move into frame and do a T pose. Hold for a few seconds and then relax and run through the motions. Once we're done, we stop the recording. And now we open up the studio version from iPi and we can line up our actor with the video feed that we received from the Kinect and click refit to adjust the model to the position of the feed and click track forward. And now you can see that our model is tracking forward with the video feed from the Kinect. And after that's done, we can do a further jitter adjustment as well as better refinement track. Now with that done, we can export to a 3ds Max file format, bring that into 3ds Max and apply it to a biped using the load motion capture data under the biped parameters and save out the movements again to be able to apply to any skinned rig you have. I recommend you guys check out the software and test it out. It's really awesome and hopefully it will benefit you guys. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe for more content. Thanks guys.